G'day everybody and welcome to another YouTube video review. Today we're going to be having a look at the Star Wars Stormtrooper helmet. Uh, this is a replica brought out by uh, uh, EFX Helmets and uh, as you can see in the box there and this is from the, the New Hope. So this is uh, according to the theory uh, behind it it's taken from a sculpt of the, uh, one of the seven originals uh, helmets that was used in the film. So anyway we'll have a quick look at the box for you. It's nothing that exciting. It's a huge box, big black box but uh, has a little bit of information on the back, so I'll give you a look at that. You can see there, so you've got the picture of the Stormtrooper uh, with the helmet in the actual movie. Uh, it's basically, it's, as I say, it's based on the original helmet from the Lucasfilm archives, quality ABS construction, full-scale replica, and it's officially licensed. So, um, and the blurb there goes on to tell you about the Stormtrooper being the most recognised symbol of the evil galactic empire. But anyway, I'm sure you don't want to look at the box, I'm sure you want to look at the helmet. So first thing I'll do is I'll compare it to the first Stormtrooper helmet I ever did a review on and straight away you can see a huge size difference uh, even in width as in height. Um, you'll notice too that on the, uh, the replica one we have the green tinted lenses and on the uh, sort of the uh, Ruby's replica we have the black lenses. Now remember I think when I did the review I said basically it's really hard to see out of this one through the lenses but with this one it um, no problems whatsoever. So let's have a look at the helmet. Uh, as you can see there, it's all beautifully molded together with the construction. You have the, uh, the painted edges, you have the correct detail. You can see there's the lens. I'll give you a look inside the helmet in a minute. You've got the air vents. They actually have a, uh, a thin layer of mesh inside so you can actually breathe through. There's air through there. Whereas on the Ruby's one, it's just dead set plastic and painted black. So. A little bit different there, then you've got the grill at the front. Very nice detail, moving around now. So you've got the rubber strip all the way around. And then the back of the helmet, you can see there as well. So on the inside, again you can see the lenses there, the green lenses, you've got the padding around the eyes. You'll also notice the padding around the head of the helmet. It's uh, quite large, fit. this will definitely fit any size head, this one. There's the mesh inside there for the breathing holes. You can see the join where the pieces have been put together, but it is rather flawless. Uh, you can't really tell. Nothing like the, the Hasbro replicas that you see there for the kids' versions. This actually is a, a really great addition to any collection. So if you're a bit of a Stormtrooper fan and you're looking for, uh, for something to pick up, then uh, if you haven't already, I uh, highly recommend this one. Picked it up for a reasonable price. Um, but uh, I'm sure you can find them cheaper on eBay or the likes of the internet and things like that. So, anyway, thanks for watching. Keep subscribing. Uh, if you hang around, I'll be doing a review shortly on my Solid Snake uh, vinyl collectible figure there. And I'll also be having a look at the Spider Man to go along with the Ghost Rider and Wolverine, who I've already done. So, anyway, thanks for watching. Cheers.